Today on Low Carb with Jennifer, I'm going to show you how to make this low carb breakfast burrito for one. Hey guys, welcome back to Low Carb with Jennifer. Today I'm going to show you a breakfast, how to make a breakfast burrito super simply for one person. You can double or triple or quadruple this recipe for more people, but I really like making recipes like this. They're perfect if it's just you and you just, um, you just want to cook for you. So we're gonna start with a skillet. And I'm telling you this, you may be like, oh my God, we're using a skillet. This, I'm, this recipe is super easy. You don't even have to cook your egg in a skillet. You could just cook it in the microwave, but we're going to use a skillet. So I'm gonna spray it with nonstick spray. If you have a nonstick skillet, then that wouldn't be a big of a deal. And I'm gonna go ahead and crack my egg into this skillet. And I'm going to season it with just like a pinch of salt. And I'm gonna just scramble it up with my spatula. Okay, we're gonna let that cook. I've got a low carb tortilla. This is a La Banderita soft taco size tortilla. Um, it's actually, I think, bigger than soft taco, but that's what they call it, soft taco size. So I've got it on a plate on standby, but before I put my eggs on it, I'm going to put some cheese on it, about one serving of cheese. Also on standby is my sausage. I've already heated this up in the microwave. This is just two sausage links. These are chicken sausage, but you don't have to use chicken sausage. Um, I'm not even going to chop them up. I'm just going to put them in the burrito just like this. And also on standby is a holy guacamole cup. I love these things. It's a little 100 calorie guacamole cup. Um, they also have just plain avocado. And these are so good for things just like this. Recipes just like this. Or I like to dip uh, red bell pepper slices in it. Perfect. Our egg is starting to scramble. Okay, we've got our egg scrambled, so I'm going to scoop it out on top of my cheese. And you could do more than one egg, but this, these tortillas fill up really fast, and if you put any more stuff, it's going to be harder to wrap. Okay, I'm going to set this aside, but I'm, not, I'm just going to turn the heat down. I'm not going to turn it off because I want to use it to grill my tortilla. Okay, now let's spread our guacamole on there. And then we're gonna put our sausage, just like that. And now it's time to wrap it up. Okay, now I'm gonna put it straight into the skillet, seam side down just to get it browned on both sides. And these can be put in the freezer if you want to wrap them in plastic wrap or foil, and then you can freeze them each individually. And then you'd probably want to put them in like a, a zip top bag that's freezer, freezer safe or a, a bowl that's freezer safe. And then when you want to heat them, you could just pull one out of the freezer, take the foil or the plastic wrap off and put them in the microwave you're gonna to wanna to probably put them on defrost for a couple minutes. And then if you want, you could re, um, I would do that before I sear them in the skillet. And then you could just sear it in the skillet after it's cooked a little bit in the microwave. But we've just about got this one good. So let's put it on our plate. And I'm gonna cut into it carefully. It is hot. And how good does that look? So there you have it. A quick, super simple breakfast. You can make these ahead of time and then it would be literally ready to go in five minutes. So be sure you check out this recipe and I will see you guys next time. Bye.